Hi guys, this is Yaka. I weren't really planning on um, recording much of this run, but as it turns out, it, it went pretty well. Uh, the curve, just to talk a little bit about the deck, the curve is a little bit awkward. Um, I have like a gap in the 4 and 5 slot, but uh, anyway, the deck seems to work out just fine. There are a bunch of it's kind of a, it's a value thing. I can play some early game, but it's it's mainly focused around um, uh, doing value plays, getting more cards. I have stuff in there that generates a lot of cards. The Totolan Primalist is really really good. There's a lot of very good cards in them. Uh, in Mage, uh, not just the board clears. I haven't really actually Totolan, I don't think, it's ever given me a board clear, but I already have those uh, in the deck. Two Flame Strikes, a Blizzard, Fireball, stuff like that. I have a lot of, I would say the deck works around me having answers to whatever threats that my opponent drops, and then I have some high value cards that I can drop. Um, as something that they need answers for, and many times they haven't had uh, these answers readily available. Uh, the two losses that I've had is one was uh, where it went completely into attrition. My, there has probably been during the course of the game a few misplays, I didn't play for enough value, uh, and then because I just thought I had it, and then it ended out me. Uh, uh, not winning towards the end of uh, the game of me burning uh, burning my entire deck through actually it's just rather unusual in the arena and the other one I played I was too greedy I played a little bit too valuable and tried to get a little bit more out of my flame strikes and stuff like that and uh, uh, the warlock I was facing actually managed to just squeeze in the last point of damage that actually uh, ensured him the win and, um, it was a pretty close call also for the, the Warlock. Um, but uh, let's see if we can make this uh, final boss battle count. Um, and we'll see if we'll manage. Jaina versus Rexa! Right. There's actually some synergy between Vicious Fletchling and the Blood Knight, you get Divine Shield, and then you buff up this one. It's completely crazy. These are going back. I would much rather draw the counter spell out of my Arcanologist. Um, and even though I'm starting with the coin, and then it wouldn't be that bad, then that's perfectly fine. Forbidden Flame is a really good pick up here. That's just fine, getting rid of that one. It'll limit me, anyway. Pick up a Divine Shield, which will work really well with my Blood Knight. Mm -hmm. Or else I might pick up a... I wonder. <sighs> Volcanic Potion, Frost Bolt, something like that. I think actually Fireball here. Then I won't be playing squeamish with it. I need to clear the vicious flesh game. He should have run out of steam a lot sooner um, than, than I actually will. Another one, man! I need to play something into that. Glacial Shard is an excellent, excellent, excellent play into this. Might have an answer for this, if not. Oh man, Hoffer and then what? Grievous Point. No. 
dude. I'm not sure that was the right move. Death rattle, all right. Yeah, let's go that way. And we'll ping it. He'll be incentivized to use it to trade with instead of going face. Which should be really good. But it's definitely a small counter. And now I'm forcing him to think. Wow, what a concept. Stabilize now. I can clear the board with what is left there. It's three health, alright. Stealth actually might be the better choice. Yeah, let's go stealth mode. And then we trade up into Idiot. this. And then we clear Hoffa. 10 damage. It seems like I'm in a good spot, but I have to be a bit cautious here. Ouch. So that's what. Uh, it might be lethal, actually. Uh, three, nine, thirteen, twenty-one. If I get the plus three attack, should be it, right? That's not it. That's not it. Six, ten, eleven. Arm um, one short. I miscounted. But then I can do this. And I can do this. Glory to the Sindora. Needs to deal with all of this. 11 damage with 8 mana. Shouldn't be able to do that. Wow! Seem like it is a setup for. Um, Explosive trap. But there's a bunch of stuff that will speed the game anyway. Mm, Tatolan might do it. But uh, like it's not really. Flame Geyser. That should be it, right? Two damage. I go face, explosive trap, and then I finish him off. 12 win guys against the smart hunter. Oh, you don't want to stick around. Alright guys. <laughs> An amazing, although quick finish to this run that I didn't expect would go 12 with this weird curve and everything. Two 
packs. Nice. 260 gold. Let's see if there's something good in here. I think I'm long overdue for a legendary. Feels like that. Anyway. Alright, let's see guys. Ah, a good pack nonetheless. Pretty good. Alright. An amazing finish, a good run. Thanks for watching guys.